Where am I, man? I'm not sure what's going on here yet, but I think probably a soccer game, AKA football. A classic scene here in Khrushchevat on a nice sunny day. Lots of produce for sale. And I'm on my way to the Devil's Town. It's gonna be a couple hours drive. My car is parked up ahead. I just stopped to uh, capture this nice uh, little shopping street. People waiting for uh, something that must be good. And there, pastries or something. And the car is right down here. Time to get going. So I just drove past this uh, classic looking market here in Krusevac. I'm just uh, trying to get out of here, but keep seeing cool stuff along the way. And I uh, had to give a little tour. See what kind of stuff they got here. Man, this is the real deal. Like if you want to fix your house or your car, I'm sure everything is at a very affordable price. And lots more in here, looks like. Maybe this will be the food market. Nope, clothes. I need some breakfast, actually. All right, where's all the grub? I guess uh, it was back at that other place. All right, gonna get out of here. Well, we have uh, food there, but that's it. Just like fast food. All right, exit and hitting the road. I have no idea what this town is, but uh, it is a cute little one, and there were a couple of markets, one right there, and a bigger one over here, so I'm gonna grab some random breakfast, lunch type of items. For anyone wondering what the uh, like COVID restrictions are here in Serbia, then basically it's just uh, wear a mask in markets and maybe like on the bus or whatever, but uh, that's pretty much it. Here we go. I'll show you what I got. 
so nobody was wearing a mask in there. I guess uh, they're not really taking it too seriously out here in the little villages. And so I got a peach smoothie, a strawberry smoothie, a hunk of cheese, whatever this is, I'm not really sure. I think like a nut thing, raisins and nuts, some kind of like bar type of deal, I guess. Fig Newtons, whatever these are, like donut holes, juice, and two bags of crackers, nine bucks. Let's find out what this thing is about. It's pretty good, it's super sweet. Very kind of soft and doughy on the inside. And then some jelly in the middle. And lots of sugar on the outside. But yeah, it's good. Berliokovice? Nein. Nein? Berliokovice? City name? Berliokovice. Yeah. Nein. Berliokovice. Ah, okay. Yeah, no. Down and around. Okay, it's good. Tourist, tourist, yeah. Deutsch, yeah. No Deutsch, no. Alright, so, uh, I just, uh, drove through this town and it looked really cool, so I decided to pull off and just kind of wind around and check it out, and ended up at this monastery here. Uh, the amazing view, and so I was trying to ask the guy what the name of the town was. I was looking on the map, and there's something nearby called Veljokovice, so this uh, might be the town name, but uh, not really sure, but what a view. I put the uh, t-shirt on here so that I could be a little more respectable going up to the monastery. All right, it is the St. Nicholas Monastery, and we've got some English here. It was built by Stefan Nemanja from 1159 to 1168. Wow, really old. One of the oldest monuments of medieval architecture in Serbia. On the building can clearly be observed Byzantine-style construction, Romanesque style. Wow. I really hope I can go inside.
So check it out. That guy has a guitar. They all had instruments. They're a band that was sitting here waiting for a taxi. <laughs> that is so funny. I thought they were just, you know, some dudes hanging out drinking or whatever. I wonder where they were playing? In the monastery or something? Probably not. Funny. Natural Monument, Devil's Town. Devil's Town is a geomorphologic phenomenon in the south of Serbia on the slopes of the Radon Mountain. The locale is comprised of 202 earthen figures formed by erosion and springs with strongly acidic and mineralized water. The earthen figures between 2 and 15 meters tall and 0.5 to 3 meters wide with stone caps on tops are the result of erosive processes that lasted for centuries. And it is a uh, hot sunny day, but not as hot as it could be. Because it is early September, you're just barely starting to see the uh, leaves turning on the trees, so fall is on the way. I'm not sure exactly how much of a walk this is going to be, but uh, one way to find out. And so when I was looking at uh, the best places to see in Serbia, then this came up, and this was like one of the places that I was the most excited to see. But what a nice setting here in these trees. Here we go, ticket office. Uh, one ticket, please. I totally didn't expect this forested terrain here because the main images that you see of Devil's Town are completely and totally different, as you'll be seeing very soon. I'm not sure how soon. I have no idea how much of a hike I'm getting into here, so... Saxon mines date back to the 13th century when the Germanic tribe Saxon dug iron ore in this region. And speaking of iron ore, I'm going to take a wild guess that that is what is making this uh, stream orange coming out of this cave. Trippy, it is just so mucky. Here we go. The first look at the Devil's Town.
Where am I, man? I'm not sure what's going on here yet, but I think probably a soccer game, aka football. Hey, <laughs> 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 All right, gonna keep on uh, driving to Niche where I have a uh, room for the next couple of nights. Yeah, <laughs> 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 